Have you ever heard of Hügelkultur? No? Well, you're in for a treat. In the vast realm of gardening, one technique that's been quietly gaining momentum is Hügelkultur. Derived from German words, Hügelkultur literally translates to hill culture, and it's an eco-friendly and sustainable method of creating raised garden beds using decaying wood and other organic matter. Now, why would you want to do that? Well, there are a myriad of benefits to this approach. One of the most significant advantages is improved soil fertility. As the wood and organic matter decay, they release nutrients back into the soil, creating a rich and fertile growing medium. Another fantastic benefit is water conservation. The decaying wood acts like a sponge, absorbing water and releasing it slowly over time. This reduces the need for frequent watering, making it a boon in regions with water scarcity. And the cherry on top? This process promotes natural decomposition, turning waste into a resource. So, ready to create your own Hügelkulte bed? Let's dive into the process. Creating a Hügelkulte bed involves several steps, but don't worry, each one is simple and straightforward. Let's dive in. Firstly, we need to choose a location. A spot that gets plenty of sunlight and is easily accessible for watering and maintenance is ideal. Now that we have our perfect spot, we move on to gathering materials. This includes logs, branches and other woody materials. If you stumble upon old or rotting wood, don't hesitate to use it. It actually helps speed up the decomposition process. Next, it's time to roll up those sleeves and dig a trench in our chosen area. The size is flexible, but typically a Hügelkulte bed is about one to two feet high and three to six feet wide. Once we have our trench, we fill it with our collected logs and branches. Remember, the larger pieces go at the bottom. This wood base acts like a sponge, holding moisture and providing nutrients over time. With the base in place, we move on to adding organic matter. This is where leaves, straw, compost and grass clippings come into play. Layer these on top of the wood to accelerate decomposition and create a fertile growing medium. Next on our list is the soil layer. Add a layer of topsoil or garden soil on top of the organic matter. This is where your plants will make their home. To keep this soil cosy and moist, cover it with mulch. This helps retain moisture, regulate temperature and keep those pesky weeds at bay. Now comes the fun part, planting. You can plant your desired crops right in the soil layer. One of the many perks of Hügelkulte beds is their water retention ability, which can reduce the need for frequent watering. And finally, water your Hügelkultur bed initially to settle the materials. Afterward, the decaying wood will help maintain moisture levels, so you may find you need to water less frequently than traditional garden beds. With the base ready, it's time to add the organic matter. This is where the magic happens. Now that we have our wood base, it's time to layer on the organic matter. Our next step is to pile on organic goodies like straw, leaves, compost and grass clippings. This layer will help accelerate the decomposition of the wood beneath and create an irresistibly fertile growing medium for your plants. Next, we'll add the soil layer. This is typically topsoil or garden soil and it's where you'll plant your crops. This soil layer acts as a bridge between the organic matter and the plants, allowing nutrients to be absorbed and promoting healthy growth but we're not done just yet. The final layer is mulch. Mulch is a wonderful addition to any garden bed, but in a Hügelkulte bed, it's particularly important. It helps to retain moisture, regulate soil temperature, and suppress those pesky weeds. Mulch also adds an aesthetically pleasing finish to your bed and gives it a neat, well-cared-for look. Now your Hügelkulte bed is almost ready. It's a layered masterpiece of organic matter, soil, and mulch, all sitting atop a foundation of decaying wood. You can almost hear the soil teeming with life, ready to nourish your plants. With the bed prepared, all that's left is to plant your crops and water the bed. The initial watering will help to settle all the materials. From then on, the decomposing wood at the base of your Hügelkulte bed will do much of the watering work for you. And that, my friends, is the beauty of Hügelkulte gardening. So, you've created your Hügelkulte bed. But what exactly are the benefits? Well. Hügelkultur is a marvel of sustainability. It thrives on water conservation, reducing the need for frequent watering. It also improves soil fertility over the years, as the decaying wood enriches the soil with nutrients. And let's not forget, 
It's a fantastic way to recycle organic waste. There you have it, a step-by-step -step guide to creating a Hugel Kultur bed. This eco-friendly method is a fantastic way to improve your garden and help the environment. Happy gardening!